So Paige, did you ever think that someday they would be making a movie about your family's story? I never thought this day would be here. It blows my mind every day. Like at 26 years old to have a biopic done in you, like that's crazy. And then having the producer to be Dwayne Johnson and, and Stephen Merchant as the writer and director, like what the hell is going on around here? It's cool. Very cool. Um, obviously you've had to fight really hard to get um, to where you are. Your story is inspiring. What do you hope that young girls can take away from this? Well, I, I just hope that they can be truly and wholeheartedly themselves. Like, that's a really good uh, message that I like to uh, portray, especially, you know, in my story, is just I tried to be something that I wasn't for a hot second in the movie, and then I realized uh, being myself was my superpower, and it got me to where I am today. So I hope they walk away inspired by that. Um, talk about what it was like to see the other actors playing your family members. It, it was strange to like, uh, cause I got to watch it with Florence who was sitting right next to me at Sundance and she was just like sinking lower and lower into her chair because she was just like, this is so weird that I'm sitting next to you playing you on the big screen right now. And she just did such an incredible job. And then you look at my family and you think like it's, like super scripted the way they are, but they're just like animated like that. They're insane, they're outrageous, they're like um, outspoken, they're just, they're crude like that, you know? Um, what was it like working with Steven? It was really incredible. I was, I've was i always been a big fan of his work, like I love The Office, like it's still one of my favorite shows, I loved it. Um, and he was so hands-on with everything too, like he, he would call and text me um, every other day and just be like, okay, well, how are you feeling in this moment? Who are you talking to, you know? So he was really passionate about this movie and it, and it made me love him even more. And how about The Rock? He's so great, isn't he? He's so wonderful. He's just a really beautiful human being inside and out. Like what you see is what you get with Dwayne. So uh, I don't think there's even a bad bone in his body. Um, what would you say to anybody trying to break into the wrestling uh, world today? What advice would you have for them? I would give them the same advice as Dwayne gave me, and that's to stay humble and hungry. H humble because you want to be able to work with people, and people want to be able to work with you. And hungry because you always want to set goals, you don't want to get complacent, you, want, you don't want to get, you know. Um, and also uh, to be patient because it all isn't just handed to you, you know. Um, has your family seen the film, and what was their reaction? Oh my gosh, they lost it. They lost it. So my dad, like, he's quite the character, as you probably seen in the movie if you watched it already. Um, he was he was a little bit annoyed because at first he was just like, why is Ray Winston not playing me? He just didn't understand. Like he's very like old school with his movies. He didn't really know Nick Frost very well. And I was like, dad, he's very talented. I promise you, like he's gonna do a good job. And as soon as he saw it, he was like, oh yeah, he's pretty good, isn't he? Like they, he loved it and the whole family loved it. My brother, Zach, called me literally straight away after the movie and he was like, I just wanna say I love you. And I was like, I love you too. They loved it. That's cool. Yeah. Um, audiences obviously love the movie from Sundance to Snoop Dogg. Um, mm -hmm. Why do you think that it resonates with everybody? It's just a very relatable story. And also um, everyone loves a good underdog story too. You know, and there's not a lot of uh, female sports-based movies like this. You know, it's like it's it's so similar to Rocky as well. It's just it's not just a, a wrestling movie. Like Rocky was not just a boxing movie. It was just about family. It was about struggles. It was about rags to you know uh, a riches kind of story. You know, it's just um, a very relatable thing.